Hey, what's up, guys? I was casually scrolling in Pinterest, as you do, and I came across this. Look how pretty that is. And of course, I had this sudden Thank urge you. to build it in blocks of earth. So let's get right into this. I'm going with four by four. So the bed has a metal white frame. So let's see what we have in the game. Because I'm sure we have those beds, those metal frame beds. Oh my god, where do they go? I swear we had those industrial beds. Oh my god, didn't we have a bed like to match this chair? Why did they take the beds off? I know it was giving like horror men of a patient, but why did they take it off? I actually wanted to use it. <laughs> Tell me I'm not going mad. Oh my god, it's here. I am still pinned. Oh my god, so this is the bed. So our bed is going to go here. And of course our bedding is going to be red. Oh my god, it looks so much better in white. So shall I add the little balls? They still haven't added spheres in the game, which is pretty rude of them. Oh, nasty. And that's what so rude. There we go, that was easy enough. I'm just gonna use transform tool. So we'll have that about there. And the same for the other side and then we have our little ball which goes on top and obviously i just need to repeat that for each corner of the bed oh my god it is seriously those little details which make all the difference but right, this is going to be my favorite part of the bedding it's just layers upon layers upon layers of blankets and pillows and blankets and pillows and blankets. get what i'm saying right so i'm going to go for this just going to make this one really large actually then we have these smaller trimmed ones right what do we think about that i think there's plenty of pillows there now so i'll probably go for this one nice. so what i'll do is place a painting onto a transparent cube and get that onto the wow. bed right now we've got stockings on the end of the bed with some sort of garland so let's see if i have anything from the christmas update so i've got these you can see here also there is a garland which runs along the frame Bruh. the closest thing i can think of which is close to a pom-pom is this baby rattle but i'm gonna have to place them individually along the bed frame your then I'm going to place my string along the bed frame. So now I'm going to use this string as a guideline to place my rattles. So let me get started. So our first pom pom is in, and in goes our second one. And now I've just got to follow the string and continue placing my pom poms. Probably wondering why would I actually put myself through this? It's because I've actually got nothing better to do. No, I'm actually joking. It's because I really want to make this build look as close as possible to the actual picture. So tell me why. Tell me why. I spent like 3,000 years carefully placing each pom pom down. and this side looks higher than this side. I mean, why is Boxberg always doing me dirty? Right, now uh. I'm going to put in the bench with the little gnome and the candles uh, and plus the slippers. So let me try and find a bench. Right, so I could probably use this one. What the hell? Who actually uses this? Please tell me no one uses this. It's just it's such an odd shape. Right, so I'm going to stick with this bench, but I'm just going to add a few rods. So there we go. Right, so how am I going to make this little gnome? So let me see what I can come up with. I'll use this for the body. So I'm going to use one of these, one of these fountain fireworks. So I'm going to pop this firework on top. I'm probably going to see if I can resize this. This is little nose. Why is that looking pretty cute? What can I use for the beard? Oh, the little birdie work as a beard. I'm convinced I can use this as a beard. What if I turn it around? I think that's looking more like beardy. Uh, well, I'm just going to go with that. Okay, he's going to have real skinny legs. <laughs> <laughs> that's looking weird let's just make them a little bit bigger and i've got to dangle the rest of these legs down oh my god why is one leg shorter than the other Bloxburg, make this make sense what the actual heck his leg is too big um I've, i think they're a bit too spread apart as well let's little does he know that his head is about to be blown off it is our lantern and we can't forget our little slippers so I've basically done the garland, stocking, gnomes, lighting. So let's move up to the other side of the bed. So we've got our two bedside cabinets. So I'm going to go with this bedside table. I need to customise the stand for the lamp. So what I might do is use this here. Basically, all I've got left to do is the window and the tree. Oh my god, I didn't see that. There is a garland running along the top side of the bed. I could use this and just change it to greens. This is just giving slug. It is so ugly. What the heck even is that? So I'd rather use this and I'll probably just add a few bows to give it that festive feel. Right, so the curtains will just be decals. So I could use the in-game tree, just colour it all white. 
I'm gonna do that real quick. If you haven't already seen the video, um, I'll link it in the video description below, which is a fuller tutorial on how to make a realistic looking tree. So I'm looking at this pretty little wreath on the window, and then I'm looking at the one that they have in Bloxburg. <laughs> This is going to ruin my build. Like this is giving slug and then this is giving slug all curled up. Oh, I just don't like it. I think that's what I'll do. I'll just stick a decal on there. And if worse comes to worse and I can't actually find a decal, then I'm going to have to go with that. So I've come to the point now where I've actually built everything in the Pinterest picture. What I'm going to do is just freestyle the rest of the room so it looks more complete. So I'm going to do that all off camera of course because i don't want to bore you to death and i'll see you in a bit for the tour yeah welcome back guys so i built a room off pinterest which was a christmas bedroom themed room um so let's go and take a look so i'm gonna pop the picture on screen from pinterest so you can actually compare the two so i tried to make it as similar as possible so we have our metal framed bed with our pom-pom garland running along and then we have this lovely nordic pattern bed cover at the end of the bed there is a bench with a little gnome and a lantern his hat by the way is a firework so he might pop off anytime soon we've got a stocking at the end as well with another little gnome inside let's just come over here we can see our curtains the reef on the window we've got our bedside tables here and then basically i made a custom tree because i wasn't really feeling the tree that we have in game so all of this is from pinterest and the rest i just added i just basically freestyled it so we've got a little reading area here our wardrobe i put one of these plaques on the door handle and i think that looks really cute over on this side i just had to add a fireplace to make the room look even more cozier just added a lot of the christmas items from last year i've got um some Christmassy wallpaper going on in the background um a decal on a mantelpiece and yeah just some shelves on either side i've got my chandelier in with a ceiling decal and yeah that is basically it it, guys so please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it comment below what you want me to build next and i'll see you in the next one see ya